Smile and learn. Hello, everyone. Today, I'd like to take you on a trip across the continents of the world. Come along with me. Do you know how many continents are there, and what are their names? Did you know that scientists find it hard to define the number and names of the continents? They don't have a clear answer. Well, while they're making up their minds, we're going to be following this map, which shows six continents. As you can see, the surface of the Earth consists of massive land masses, separated by oceans. A continent is an expanse of land, which is geographically and culturally differentiated from other continents. There are six continents on our planet. Europe, Africa, Asia, the Americas, Oceania, and the Antarctic. These six continents are separated by five oceans. The Pacific Ocean, the Atlantic Ocean, the Indian Ocean, the Antarctic Ocean, and the Arctic Ocean. Let's have a closer look at each one of these continents. The Americas. Owing to its size, geographical features, and cultural characteristics, this continent is divided into North America, Central America, and South America. The Americas cover almost 30% of the Earth's total land area. The Americas. Asia. Asia is the largest and most populated continent on Earth. It is divided into North Asia, South Asia, East Asia, Central Asia, Southeast Asia, and West Asia. Asia. Africa. Africa is the third largest continent in the world, after Asia and the Americas. The word Africa comes from Latin. It means free of cold. Africa. Europe. Europe is also known as the Old Continent and is bordered by the Arctic and Atlantic Ocean. Europe. Oceania. Oceania is made up of the island of Australia, New Guinea Islands, New Zealand, and several archipelagos like Polynesia. Oceania is surrounded by the Pacific and Indian Ocean. Oceania. The Antarctic. This continent has no indigenous population, but it is visited by many scientists from all over the world. 98% of its surface is covered by ice. The Antarctic. We have traveled the world. As you were able to observe, the continents from largest to smallest by size are Asia, the Americas, Africa, the Antarctic, Europe, and Oceania. And the continents from largest to smallest by population are Asia, Africa, the Americas, Europe, Oceania, and the Antarctic. It has been a sensational trip. We have learned so much about the six continents of the world. Can you remember all of them? Which is this continent? Europe. How about this one? Africa. And this large continent. Asia. Which is this continent? The Americas. Would you be able to name this one? Oceania. One more to go. Which continent is this one? The Antarctic. Way to go! See you on our next trip. Bye-bye, explorers. Hello, friends. 
Today, I'd like to take a trip around our planet to learn about the oceans. Would you like to join me? Look at the Earth. As you can see, 71% of the Earth's surface is covered with water. Our planet is divided into vast land masses, separated by large expanses of water. These expanses of water are called oceans. Do you know how many oceans are there and what are their names? There are five oceans on Earth. The Arctic Ocean, the Pacific Ocean, the Atlantic Ocean, the Indian Ocean, and the Southern Antarctic Ocean. Let's find out more about each one of them. The Pacific Ocean. The Pacific Ocean is the largest of all five oceans on Earth. It stretches from the shores of the Americas to Asia and Oceania. Ferdinand Magellan named it the Pacific Ocean because during his sea voyage, the waters were calm and peaceful. The deepest place on the planet is located here in the Pacific Ocean and is known as the Mariana Trench. Did you know that the Great Barrier Reef is also located in the Pacific Ocean? The Atlantic Ocean the Atlantic Ocean stretches from the Arctic Ocean to the Antarctic Ocean, bounded on the west by the Americas, and on the east by Europe and Africa. Did you know that it is the second largest ocean on our planet? The first steamship to cross the Atlantic from New York to England was the SS Savannah. In 1838, The Indian Ocean The Indian Ocean is bounded on the east by Africa and the Middle East, and on the south by Asia and Australia. It is the third largest and warmest ocean on the planet. In the course of history, due to east-west commerce, the Indian Ocean became an important throughway for transport. The Arctic Ocean the Arctic Ocean is located around the North Pole and is the shallowest of all oceans. The largest part of the Arctic Ocean is covered with ice, which, owing to global warming, is slowly shrinking. Besides being the smallest ocean, it is important to life on Earth. The Southern Ocean The Southern Ocean, also known as the Antarctic Ocean, is located in the southernmost waters of our planet. It stretches from the Antarctic coast to the Atlantic Ocean, the Pacific Ocean, and the Indian Ocean. The Antarctic Circle is marked on maps as one of the major circles on Earth. The water temperature in the Southern Ocean is very low, varying from negative 2 degrees Celsius to 10 degrees Celsius. Today we traveled around the world as you have seen, the oceans from the largest to the smallest are the Pacific Ocean, the Atlantic Ocean, the Indian Ocean, the Southern Ocean, and the Arctic Ocean. Oceans are beautiful places and have a significant influence on our planet. Numerous species of animals and plants and many types of ecosystems can be found in the oceans. Unfortunately, Contamination and global warming threaten ocean life. That's why it is really important to look after the oceans and protect the environment. This has been a sensational trip. We have learned everything about the five oceans on our planet. Can you remember all of them? The Arctic Ocean. The Atlantic Ocean. The Southern Ocean. The Indian Ocean. The Pacific Ocean. Well done, explorers. See you soon for our next trip. We've learned so much in just one video. Did you know there are many more videos? 
Imagine how much you could learn. Subscribe to the Smile and Learn educational channel to learn and have fun at the same time.